I heard lots of rumors about this place. A famous one is about a legendary honor student who ate a dragon egg and turned into a legendary delinquent. Aren't you curious being an honor student and all? Fine, let's hear it. But only if it tells whether he ate it with salt and pepper or hot sauce. You're really hung up on that, huh? It's my greatest concern at this point. One of my goals is to make hot sauce the official condiment for eggs. You still hate salt and pepper? Disliking things is key to being an honor student. Who wants to eat all their vegetables? We eat everything on the plate. Food group be damned. No honor student can claim that. Our lady eats all the school lunches for our absent classmates. And since everyone is always absent, that's like 30 lunches a day. How is that even possible? Once I take home ec, I'm gonna make you a feast that you'll eat to the very last bite. <laughs> More of your useless meddling. Huh? So you've never gone to a home economics class, Miss Barrow? But I thought you had perfect attendance. I do, but home ec's a special case at this school. No one knows where the kitchen room is. And none of the teachers have ever seen the home ec teacher. None of the fearless badasses who went looking for the cooking class have ever been seen again. The school is full of stories about never being seen again. There it is! That's the dragon egg, right? That was pretty easy. We didn't even see the shadow from this legendary dragon. Shouldn't there be more action and adventure than this? Fool, stop daydreaming! Reality is never that romantic! Hey, stop right there! <laughs> Who dares tell me what to do? Cooking is love! Cooking is power! Cooking is serenity! <sighs> More weirdos. I wonder if they're comedians. Puta! We are chefs! Under order from a master, we will take the dragon egg! <laughs> you plan to steal from an honor student? <laughs> I'll slice you up and serve you smoked with my dragon egg breakfast!
So this is the legendary dragon egg. If... if only... I eat this egg, that would make you the number one delinquent of all time. Indeed. In all of our long history, no demon has ever successfully opened up their heart. So if I eat it, I'll stop Mal from becoming a badass, and I'll snag the title of number one delinquent forever! But even though that'll solve all my problems, I just can't do it! Stealing is for honor students. Even if I did open my heart like that, I wouldn't be following the badass way. It would be so uncool. I couldn't stand to face the light of day. My lady, if by any chance Mao does open his heart, I'll just have to find a way to be a bigger badass than him. That's why we're such good enemies. And friends. And ultimately, rivals. Amazing, my lady. I'm glad you think so. Hey, Beryl, what's wrong with this egg? I can't seem to crack it. Really? You can't even crack a defenseless egg and you call yourself an honor student? <sighs> Are you saying that a delinquent can? With what I do on a daily basis, I can crack it in one shot. <laughs> it's impossible. You can't crack that egg. You guys are still here. The only one in the entire netherworld who can cook that dragon egg is our master. If I had more time, I would have found its harmonic seam, where it's most vulnerable. But seeing as how there's a quicker way, tell me where your master is. He's in the home at cooking lab. However, it's virtually impossible to find. You could spend a lifetime trying. <laughs> Don't you know who I am? I'm the Academy's number one honor student. Your kitchen will be no problem to find. For my butler. You're not going to find it yourself? We're going back for now. Fake hero, roll that egg behind us. <sighs> Is this egg really going to open up Mal's heart? Maybe I should just give up getting my title back and become a demon. It'll sure be easier. What's wrong, fake hero? Do you want us to help you? Huh? Oh, thanks, but I'm all right. I'll carry it myself. Don't worry. Are you sure? You look kind of pale. If you need anything, I'll always be there to listen. Just come to see me. A demon worrying about me? How could I even consider giving up on my title? It's all that demonic title's fault. I have to do something about it quick, or I'll be a demon before I know it. I have to get Mao to open up his heart with that sunny-side-up egg and return to my real body.